Ladies and gentlemen, playtesting the Master of Harmony Hero Talents for Mistweaver Monk in the War Within beta. It feels nice to play with it, but at the end of the day it kinda feels like it's lacking something and it's not superior to the other hero talent build, Conduit of the Celestials. At least when it comes to Mythic Plus content, maybe it's gonna shine in raid and we're gonna discuss why in this video. The main idea behind those hero talents is that you generate a resource called Vitality by doing damage and healing and then when you press your Thunder Focus T, you release that Vitality to do more healing in the next 10 seconds. On paper that doesn't sound bad at all and even more so considering that you get a hero talent that gives you an extra charge for Thunder Focus T. And there are more even hero talents that increase the rate at you generate that Vitality by either doing more damage or more healing. The second charge of the Thunder Focus T is even more welcome considering that the monk lost some of the base abilities like Essence Font. Check my video of the gameplay of the Master of the Conduit's talents where I talk about this in more detail. And overall all of this should feel pretty nice playing it in dungeons but somehow it just doesn't, maybe it's just because of the scaling. And unfortunately at the end of the day the master of the harmony didn't do that much healing and that much damage looking at the meters at the end of the run. Of course it could have been just me not doing enough damage and healing to generate enough vitality so I can get more benefits after that from it. Maybe the key level was too low but comparing this to the conduit of the celestials hero talents build this one just didn't feel as powerful. Now let me mention some of the other talents that we have available in the tree because they don't sound that bad at all once you go through them. For example you can get Harmonic Gambit which allows your melee abilities to do extra damage drawing vitality once you pop your Thunder Focus T. And I was expecting to see some impressive numbers at the end of the run but somehow they were not that high. Maybe most of the vitality was just going towards healing spells. Or maybe I was just not pressing enough the single target abilities in the different situations so I can generate more value out of this. But since this talent doesn't have an AoE component, like the numbers were not what you would expect at the end of the run. You have a talent that increases the damage of Chi Burst and Chi Wave and since Chi Wave is now passively activated every 15 seconds I decided to give it a try and unfortunately it's still just bad. Without this talent the numbers that you wave generated are quite low, with it well they're still quite low, they're just a little bit less bad. Then you see even more talents that are damage connected, for example your single target melee abilities are going to do a little bit of AoE damage in a cone in front of you and rot rotating between them and nature healing spells is going to buff them with a stacking value. The capstone talent also has a healing and damaging component both by increasing the healing and damage that you do to targets affected by your aspect of harmony. And frankly all of the stacks and it feels pretty good at the end of the run when you look into the meters and you see that you actually manage to do a little bit more damage than usual. However we should also note that healer damage seems to be very insignificant and judging by the how things are going it's probably going to be the same, healer damage is not going to matter, it's all going to be about survivability during the first season in the war within. And at the same time the healing profile that you get from the aspect of the harmony doesn't seem to be that powerful in mythic plus dungeons because the healing that you get from it is in the form of a hot effect. Now don't get me wrong it's good it heals but when you compare it to the conduit of the celestials it just doesn't feel superior at all. Quite the opposite pressing thunder focus T to get some extra healing I just couldn't feel it. And that's a very resonating difference with the Conduit of the Celestials. Having said all of this though, this should feel pretty damn nice in raid. You generate more vitality from healing than from damage and all you do in raid is supposedly heal. So your Thunder Focus T stacks will become very powerful small cooldowns that you can use in that environment. The talents that were related to damage and you saw earlier all of them were kinda leaning towards single target damage as well. So based on that the most logical conclusion is that Master of Harmony is going to shine in raids. It is still viable and playable in Mythic Plus but it begs the question why would you try that if you can play 
conduit of the Celestials there, which feels much more powerful in dungeon environments. Also, potential tuning and changes could be a big factor of how this is going to turn out to be before the release of The War Within, so stay tuned to this channel for the latest changes and developments in the beta and the rest of the hero healer talent specs. Thank you very much for watching, I'll see you in the next video, now get out of here.